that I grew up in a hippie camp in Denmark. The positive thing is that you have a really free approach to people. So I don't really see boundaries in people, I see opportunities. My strongest tool has always been my ability to use my intuition, to create holistic design solutions. A designer must be given the opportunity to play. To understand where I come from, you have to understand that music is half of the picture. The unique combination of music and design has given me the opportunity to become the first ever creative director of a Danish brand called Bang Olsen. And, uh, but also as a designer, not only working for Bang Olsen, uh, my passion is also food. And we have the opportunity to design a new restaurant in Taiwan. I would like to control all elements of my design. I would like to design this chair, the lamp, the table, the glass, the sofa, the napkin, you know, all of it. But in all really great restaurants, you have to have a water element to get like the feng shui of the place working in the right way and to have the right flow of energy. So to challenge this a little bit, uh, we instead of having a water element, we actually installed a, a 35 meter long LED screen, which is transparent to show the water element and to have the fire element behind because behind this screen is the kitchen and it's kind of magical to sit there because it's like you have fire behind and you have this waterfall coming down. One of the most weird commissions ever was to design a cake. But to do a cupcake is something really particular. To this approach as well, you have to do the environment around it to be you know, as beautified as possible. So to do a minimalistic cake shop is, is, is quite difficult because most people say, say a cupcake should be a pink paradise with you know, and girly thing and so on and so on. I completely disagree. This gentleman said in 1964, and it's still true today, invention, my dear friends, is 93% perspiration, 6% electricity, 4% evaporation, and 2% butterscotch ripple. The secret to this is really, if it feels like work, you're doing it wrong.